Post Millennial from Andy No. Tenant media founders were raided just as the DOJ indictment dropped. Holy crap. We got a bunch of uh, updates here. The Blaze has fired Lauren Chen. And we also have the Washington Post reporting YouTube has taken down Tenant Media and Lauren Chen's channels. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. So here's the report from the Post Millennial. Andy No says the founders of Tenant Media, the right wing media startup accused by the U.S. DOJ of illegally taking nearly $10 million from Russian state actors to launder Russian influence were raided on Wednesday as the indictment was unsealed, according to sources who spoke exclusively exclusively with the Post Millennial. The sources who are not authorized to publicly speak on record said the authorities confiscated the electronic devices belonging to tenant media owners Lauren Chen, also known as Lauren Yu Sum Tam, I didn't know that, and her husband Liam Donovan, around the same time the Biden-Harris administration announced the indictment. I don't think the owners had any idea about the investigation, one source said. The raid just came out of nowhere. Source said the couple, who are Canadian nationals living in Tennessee, had recently returned from a trip abroad. Chen, a right-wing YouTuber and social media personality, and her husband have not commented publicly. The company's social media accounts were still posting content just before the indictment was unsealed. Sources tell the Post Millennial that tenant media staff had been kept entirely in the dark since the indictment's announcement, with the founders not communicating at all with any employees or, co- or, or contributors. Tenant media has not issued any public comment. Now, this is interesting. There was a quickly posted and deleted comment that said, fired employee here, access still. There is evidence we were actually funded by Russia, and it's a disgrace. We are traitors to America. And it was deleted within a few seconds. Very interesting. And now we have the blaze has fired Lauren Chen. I don't think they've added much else after that. And then YouTube has terminated these channels. This is absolutely crazy. And, uh, you know, the one thing I can add to this, obviously, is we had a show licensed to tenant. We do we do sponsors. Right. And now we, we like we regularly have ad sales where a company will come to us and say, we'd like to sponsor your show. And it's immediately now like, who are you? Where are you from? Why are you doing this? Because the, the, like the, the crazy thing about Lauren Chen is we've known her for so long. She's been a prominent producer for over a decade. She works for The Blaze. She uh, was a, a contributor to TP USA. And everyone was just like, oh, yeah, you know, she's starting a company. Sure. This is nuts. But uh, the crazy thing I would also add is it actually is very scary. This indictment is an allegation not yet proven in court. And that's a statement from the DOJ. The DOJ said that they said these are allegations not yet proven to be true. And these individuals are presumed innocent. And that's not reference to Lauren Chen or Liam Donovan. The crazy thing is that YouTube took down Lauren Chen's channel. YouTube terminated Lauren Chen's channel. She's not been indicted on any crime. She's not been accused of any of any crime. She's listed in this document. These are some damning allegations, but she's not yet been indicted. And YouTube just nuked their channels instantly. Tenet, I could understand. But even after that, these are still just allegations, which is kind of worrying. Yeah. Well, on the uh, Andy added an update which says uh, shortly after the report was published, Tenet Media announced privately to its staff that it was ceasing operations effective immediately. Whoa, wait, where? When did he say that? Uh, he tweet it? No, he just told me because he was watching. Oh. Um, and he just told me that you didn't update and it wasn't there at the top. And I'm looking at the Oh, story. I see it. I see it. Yeah. yeah. Shortly after this report was published, Tenet Media announced privately to its staff that it was ceasing operations effective immediately. Yeah. 